Donar is set to go, ready for takeoff. Even James Bond would be tempted by the sleek, elegant exterior. And there is no doubt its design and its technical capabilities would make Donar the star of any 007 thriller. Because even super agents wouldn't attempt to fly really close to the ground. And even the fastest motorboat will fail you over shoals and shun the beach. With Donar, however, you glide across such obstacles, literally. This totally new breed of air cushion vehicle is heading straight for a promising market segment. The six-seater hovercraft is the perfect luxurious sports or recreational vehicle. In the shallow waters of Florida or in the snow and ice-covered landscape of the Canadian winter. Donar glides across the sand dunes of Arabia as elegantly as it skims the exotic island worlds of Southeast Asia and the Far East. If your ideas, wishes, and dreams lure you to move suspended between heaven and earth, Donar lets you do this in style. Donar meets many needs. Its amphibious capabilities, independence of terrain and maneuverability, make this air cushion vehicle suitable for a variety of commercial uses as well. Specific interior designs or simple conversions enable this hovercraft to serve as a taxi in oil fields between inaccessible islands or in swamp areas. Donar itself is a tourist attraction for excursions and speedy cruises. It is suited as a fast, life-saving ambulance on inaccessible terrains or waters where the capabilities of a car, a boat and a helicopter are required all at once. For water-based police, coast guard, border patrols and nature protection services, the air cushion vehicle becomes an indispensable asset. I see, you don't fall for ads that readily, and certainly not for commercials. Well, then you are the person we have in mind, and you should take a look behind the scenes. Donar is the product of an experienced team of aircraft engineers, designers and technicians headed by the well-known German industrialist and engineer Albert Blum, whose creativity has earned him numerous awards in the past four decades. Donar is Mr. Blum's latest brainchild. A 300 horsepower engine drives two thrust propellers and a lift propeller which creates the air cushion. The 12-cylinder BMW engine is the one used in the BMW 850 series of automobiles, which means easy servicing worldwide. The rudder system, new and unique in a hovercraft, generates automatic banking in turns. Variable pitch propellers and brake flaps add increased maneuverability. But that's not the whole secret, says Albert Bloom. This hovercraft has several patented features. For example, the shift system for the air cushion, which has a particularly positive effect on turns at high speeds, and a special device allowing for higher speeds than those normally attainable with a hovercraft. The top speed of the streamlined hovercraft 120 kilometers per hour with a payload of 650 kilograms. Range, 500 kilometers for six passengers. There is something really special about moving across water or land in such a craft, a kind of cross between driving and flying. It's a very gentle and soft motion across the surface. 
No matter whether it's smooth water or rolling waves, whether on shore or in hilly terrain, or maybe on snow or ice or frozen lakes, anything is possible. Oder ob es am Ufer ist oder im hügeligen Gelände oder auch über Schnee oder Eis oder oder gefrorenen Seen, alles das ist möglich. Anything is possible, gliding with the gods. Donar, the Germanic god of thunder, wind and clouds, became the patron of the hovercraft. Donar knew why. Its design, technology and its variety of uses make this fast and agile air cushion vehicle unrivaled between heaven and earth. The exterior features a fiberglass construction of carbon fiber and Kevlar, the interior is luxuriously equipped to taste or fitted for specific uses. It's almost like flying, but it's far easier. For Donar, you don't need a pilot's license. Its handling is easily learned, and there's of course no fear of a crash landing. You're enthusiastic now but you're afraid of trouble with the environmentalists. Neither water lilies nor waterfowl are endangered. Donar floats. This air cushion vehicle generates hardly any waves that could disturb life on ship or shore. Its environmental impact is very, very low. The noise level is minimal. We use ducted fans, encased propellers, which prevent the noise from getting to the outside. There is only a minimum amount of aft noise, which, however, becomes inaudible as we reach a short distance from the coast. Schon von der Küste nicht mehr hörbar ist. Finally, a confession and a bit of rumor mongering. The cockpit lacks a warning light telling you to contain your enthusiasm. And James Bond is said to have caught the bug, secretly taking our hovercraft for a radar guided spin at night. <laughs> <laughs>